Okay, it's a snake man here. We have uh, a tiger snake. This is one of the babies uh, we've raised from birth. You, if you've been watching our YouTube videos, you would see that oh, I have actually raised this one from uh, the birth uh, uh, from the parents. Uh, the mother was killed by the Department of Sustainability. Uh, <laughs> don't bite me. <laughs> so, killed by the Department of Sustainability and Environment on a raid on the uh, uh, 17th of August uh, 2011. Anyway, uh, beautiful snake, this one. So, I don't know when it was born. It must have been born prior to that. So, uh, uh, it must have been born uh, uh, the summer prior, so end of 2010, early 2011. As you can see, it's a lovely snake. This one is a boy. Okay, and so it's age. So let's do some numbers here. What are we going to do now? 13. It's two and a half years old. It's not that big. It's only about three foot long. Anyway, it is a male, it looks pretty normal, it eats, drinks, shits. I force fed it for about the first six months, and it's been, um, you know, they eat anything you stick in front of them now, and uh, I don't feed it that much, I just don't have time, I get busy, you know, usual stuff. Anyway, here's a lovely snake, like they all are. Anyway, tiger snakes, I'm not really into tiger snakes, <laughs> I don't like them. They're like premenstrual women, you wouldn't trust your kids with them. Anyway, uh, that one can just eat it at his leisure. And uh, I'll put the lid on and introduce to to one of the other ones, uh, one of the other babies. So I gave most of them away. We don't sell our snakes. We're not into extorting money out of people. Uh, we do charge money for our expertise for reptile displays, but we do have to fund our research and efforts somehow. Anyway, uh, he wants to kill me because he's into food now. He normally lets you pick him up. Pretty friendly, you got to see. Pick him up, free handle, hand, big deal. Okay, don't try this at home. And this you are prepared to be bitten. And if you get bitten by one of these, death is a potential consequence. Anyway, right, let's get to it. By the way, I'm 51. Never had a serious bite yet. Oh, death. Now, see how quickly he took on that rodent thing? And yet, see, tail, boy. And you can see he wasn't interested in biting me. Now, of course, there is a bit of skill that comes with 51 years of handling snakes. So you know when the right time is. That's why people deal with snake busters, not inexperienced imitators. In our home state of Victoria, all the other businesses that deal with venomous snakes have had serious snake bites involving hospital, anti-venom, and in some cases, death. Only snake busters has a perfect safety record. Don't put you and your children at risk.